This day we're going to be working on a portion of the Aircrete double wall stove pipe project. And this portion of it I'm super excited about and I'll tell you why. It's the window insert. Um, the reason I love it so much is I have less than 20 bucks in it. You know, and what that means for people is anybody who wants to do some kind of a wood burning or uh, apparatus, whether it be in a basement or whether it be in a shed or something, they can just go out of a window using this method. And so I'm really excited about this. We're going to do the sheet metal portion of it today, so let's get started. The actual window opening is about 23 inches. Go ahead. Go ahead, man. Oh, you want to do that side? Here, do it in here. Do it up right there. I need a line right there. So we're going to want to have a lip to um, pop rivet it to the next piece. So let's make our lips one inch. So we will go instead of 24 inches, we will go, and this will be the bottom piece, bottom, we'll, we'll go 26. So I just have to set on my line up to the corner and then just take an angled cut right to the corner like that. And then do ya. This isn't going to fit inside of there without squishing that out. So you'll have to put it outside on one side and inside on the other. Just like that. Or maybe I can go outside, outside. Yeah, that'll work. So, in order to do this, I'm going to make sure it's perfectly square by holding a square on it. That is just what our corner detail is going to look like. We just have our U. I fastened both sides the same way as before. Um, I bent this one up just like the bottom one, same exact detail. Oh, oops. Squeeze these in. Let's go. There we go. So we squeeze the sides in until they fit in between the top. We put it on, 
You turn it upside down, just kind of force it flat and square. And there we have it. Now, I'm not going to fasten the top just yet. And the reason why is because we still have to pour this thing from the top. And I need access in from the top to um, put the sheet metal uh, circle in that the actual pipe is going to go through. So now we just need to fasten on our, our back. And we already cut it to the exact perfect length. And I'm just going to slide it in. And then the first thing I'm going to do is, once I get it slid in, okay, so I'm going to put the top rivet in. Now, if you tried to drill through this right now, it would just go boing, boing, boing. It wouldn't drill into this. So you have to turn it over. And I put boards down. And be a, a nice little backstop for me. Oh, you're going to measure it? Yes. Have you been measuring some other things too? You want to move your phone there? So? This is going on the inside all the way around. Good job, buddy. <laughs> Thanks, Bob, I helped you. <laughs> yeah, I love it when you help me. <laughs> Hey guys, if you like what we're doing, go ahead and like, subscribe, give us a thumbs up, check out uh, our Etsy store. We're uh, Honeydew Carpenter Shop on Etsy. 
and also we got some really cool other videos on air creek projects that i'm doing you can check those up in the right hand corner catch you later